Oh. Sonny, what's the hurry? I don't want Alcazar to interfere. Getting married. This whole marriage is going to happen no matter what. We might as well get it over with now. Knowing Alcazar, if, if you know, he finds out the truth about Sam's baby, he's going to go straight to Carly. This whole thing's going to blow up in our faces. Okay. Right? I guess, you know, we can get married tomorrow. I'll bring the Justice of the Peace over. It'll take no. two minutes. What do you mean, no? You want to get married? I do. Okay. I mean, I, I, not I do, I agree. Well, then yeah. let's get it over with. The, a wedding is too important to just get it over with. If we're going to get married for this baby, we might as well do it right. Look, I want, I want a real wedding in a church. Why go for a fancy church wedding with a minister when this whole thing is just a sham anyway? Well, you must have a reason. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I mean, if we're going to try and convince Alcazar that Jason is the baby's father, we might as well be married by a minister in a church. It makes sense. Getting married is getting married. I won't be marrying the man I love. I can live with that. But I want a proper wedding. Unless, I don't know, you think it's too short of a notice. I, uh... I'll call St. Timothy's and just tell them that it's really important and hopefully we can, you know, get married there the way you want. Angry about this. It's no problem. Really seemed ridiculous, me asking for a church wedding. Really didn't realize you were going to have to come down here and make the minister an offer he couldn't refuse. At least we only have a handful of guests to invite, though. Um, I'm just going to go through my closet and pick out a wedding dress, something. I mean, anything will, will do. It won't be the wedding dress of my dreams, but... You dreamt of your wedding? <laughs> yeah, I was a little kid once. All right, I think every little girl has an image in her head of what a wedding would be like. Well, what was yours? That doesn't matter. Uh, I'd, li I'd like to hear. <laughs> you know, you wouldn't. You're just going to laugh. Have I, have I ever laughed at you? I was in a church like this. Stained glass windows and candles. A long white dress and a bouquet of flowers. I could picture myself walking down the aisle, looking like a princess out of a fairy tale. Sam, a call? Yeah, it's me. Delivery. Thank you. It's a wedding dress. Do you like it? Did you send it? No. Nope. It had to be sunny. Refunds. Carly, you're back. Yeah, and just in time, because it seems like you're, you're okay. about to do something. Sam, could you just give us a minute? Mm -hmm. You know what? You drop all you want, because I have nothing to hide. Carly, come on, knock it off. How was your trip? What do you expect me to do? You want me to congratulate her on trapping you? That's, that's not what's happening. Oh, Sam, straight it's not. There's no way I'm going to let you marry her. She's a conniving little witch, Jason, and you know Carly, that please, as well as I do. It, what are you going to do? Tell me you're not going to defend her, and tell me she's, she's all sweetness and light. I'm the father of her baby, and we're getting married, Carly. You have helped me out more times than I can count. You have always been the best friend, and you have told me the truth, even if it isn't what I wanted to hear. You've pulled me back from the brink of disaster time and time again. Please just let me do you that same no, don't favor. Do me any Why? Favors. Why won't Carly, you let stay me? stay out of this. Okay? Take care of your own marriage. You should be with Sonny, Michael, and Morgan right now. You promised Michael he would get his family back, right? I, I don't want to let you throw your life away. I'm not throwing my life away. You are marrying Sam for no reason. Come on, Jason, just, just go back to plan A, okay? Wait until Sam has this baby, and then just pay her off. She's a little gold digger. Give her, give her $5 million oh, to go I, sailing I, off I into the sunset. Okay? Jason, you are a wonderful father. Honey and I will, will help you with this baby. It will grow up happy. It will grow up loved. Without its mother? Sam doesn't even want this baby. The hell I don't.
You are a real piece of work, you know that? First Jax, then you chase after my husband, then you sleep with Jason, and now you Holy think that you can wrap him to the altar? Does it look like I'm forcing him to do anything? You're using your child, and you're holding it over his head. Good night, Carly. Well, wait a minute. I, just, I have a question here. Is everyone going to ignore her past and pretend that the two of you could actually work out? That she would actually be a good wife That's for enough. you? That's enough. We're getting married tomorrow, so get used to it. Tomorrow. And there's nothing you can do to stop it. Are you having second thoughts? No. Not at all. Tomorrow night at this time, I'll be Mrs. Jason Morgan.